Question 181. Which of the following is a feature of the cool access tier for Azure storage? Option A. Significant delays in accessing your data up to several hours. Option B. Most expensive option when it comes to bandwidth cost to access your files. Option C. Cheapest option when it comes to bandwidth cost to access your files. Option D. Much cheaper to store your files than the hot access tier. And the correct answer is option D. Much cheaper to store your files than the hot access tier. Explanation. Cool access tier offers cost savings when you expect to store your files and not need to access them often. Next question. What feature within Azure will make recommendations to you about reducing cost on your account? Option A. Azure Advisor. Option B. Azure Security Center. Option C. Azure Service Health. Option D. Azure Dashboard. And the correct answer is Option A. Azure Advisor. Explanation. Azure Advisor analyzes your account uses and makes recommendations for you based on its set rules. Next question. What is single sign-on? Option A. The ability to use an existing user ID and password to sign in other applications and not have to create or memorize a new one. Option B. When you sign in to an application, it remembers who you are the next time you go there. Option C. When an application outsources Fed rates, its identity service to a third-party platform. And the correct answer is Option A. The ability to use an existing user ID and password to sign in other applications and not have to create or memorize a new one. Explanation Single sign-on The ability to use the same user ID and password to log into every application that your company has, enabled by Azure AD. Next question True or false? You can create your own policies if built-in Azure policy is not sufficient to your needs. Option A True Option B False And the correct answer is Option A True Explanation True you can create custom policies using JSON. Next question. True or false? A resource group must be in the same region as the resources inside of it. Option A. True. Option B. False. And the correct answer is Option B. False. Explanation. No. A resource group does not have to be in the same region as the resources inside of it. A resource group is a logical grouping, not a physical one. Next question. Which Azure service is meant to be a security dashboard that contains all the security and threat protection in one place? Option A. Azure Key Vault. Option B. Azure Security Center. Option C. Azure Portal Dashboard. Option D. Azure Monitor. And the correct answer is Option B. Azure Security Center. Explanation. Azure Security Center. Unified Security Management and Threat Protection. A security dashboard inside Azure portal. Next question. What hardware device is required to exist or be installed on your company network in order to set up a site-to-site -site VPN? Option A. Virtual machine. Option B. Virtual network. Option C. VPN gateway. Option D. Application gateway. And the correct answer is Option C. VPN gateway. Explanation. A VPN gateway needs to be configured to connect to Azure for a private network to be established. Next question. What type of container is used to collect log and metric data from various Azure resources? Option A. Managed storage. Option B. Append blob storage. Option C. Azure monitor account. Option D. Log analytics workspace. And the correct answer is option D. Log analytics workspace. Explanation. Log Analytics Workspace is required to collect logs and metrics. Next question. What is Azure's preferred identity or authentication service? Option A. Live Connect. Option B. Network Security Group. Option C. Azure Active Directory. Option D. Facebook Connect. And the correct answer is Option C. Azure Active Directory. Next question. What Azure tool gives you the ability to manage multiple subscriptions into nested hierarchies. Option A. Management Groups. Option B. RBAC. Option C. Resource Groups. Option D. Azure Active Directory. And the correct answer is Option A. Management Groups. Explanation. Management Groups, a hierarchy of subscriptions, can have many subscriptions and group them and put those groups into other groups. Next question. 
What makes a system highly available? Option A. Must have a minimum of 2 VMS. Option B. It's not possible to make a highly available system. Option C. If it maintains 100% availability. Option D. A system is specifically designed to be resilient with no single point of failures. And the correct answer is Option D. A system is specifically designed to be resilient with no single point of failures. Explanation High Availability A system is specifically designed to be resilient when some component of the system fails. Next question One of the benefits of the cloud is agility. What does that mean in the context of the cloud? Option A The ability to spin up new resources within minutes. Option B The ability to respond to and drive market change quickly. Option C the ability to recover from a big reason-wide failure in a short amount of time. Option D. The ability to offer system to grow its capacity easily, where it reaches full capacity. And the correct answer is option B. The ability to respond to and drive market change quickly. Explanation. Agility. The ability to respond to change rapidly based on changes to market or environment, ensuring fast time to market. Next question. A company currently has the following unused resources as part of their subscription. 10 user accounts in Azure AD. 5 user groups in Azure AD. 10 public IP address. 10 network interfaces. They want to reduce the cost for resources hosted in Azure. They decide to remove the public IP addresses. Would this fulfill the requirement? Option A. Yes. Option B. No. And the correct answer is option A. Yes. Explanation. Yes. This can reduce the cost since there is a price for public IP addressing as given in the Microsoft documentation below. Next question. The application is deployed on a set of virtual machines configured in an Azure scale set. During the application launch, the load on underlying VMS reached above 90% and the scale set spun up more stances to deal with the load. Which of the following Azure cloud benefits would ensure that the underlying application infrastructure is cost effective? and efficient. Option A. High availability. Option B. Elasticity. Option C. Disaster recovery. Option D. Fault tolerance. And the correct answer is option B. Elasticity. Explanation. Scale set and dynamic scaling based on the load is a perfect example for elasticity. Next question. You are planning to deploy a set of Azure virtual machines in your company Azure account. Your company management asked to take all possible measures to increase the availability of the underlying machines. You decide to deploy the machines across multiple resource groups. Would this meet the requirement? Option A. Yes. Option B. No. And the correct answer is option B. No. Explanation. Resource groups are used for the logical grouping of resources. For availability, you can choose to deploy either across scale sets or availability zones. Thank you for watching this video. Buy our AZ 900 premium questions with 50% off. Check link in the description.